two nights ago there was a t uh, program on television about Senegal. They show in that program um, some Muslims. So what are they doing? They are doing some sort of circumcision. <coughs> small what? girls. Circumcision. Oh? Circumcision. 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 For small girls. And then before they get married. Girls? Yeah. Very small girls. Oh, no. Two, three it's years. It's not a question of small or big. It's horrible. It's not Islamic at all. But one gentleman, he was sitting in, with open Holy Quran in front of him and he explained that he said so in Holy Quran. No. I don't know which Holy Quran he was holding in his hand. <laughs> yes. He was a big liar. There is not the slightest indication in the Holy Quran that ladies should be circumcised. Absolutely out of this. Nor were they circumcised before. The reference is given to Abraham and his Sunnah, which should be followed by Muslims. But in that Sunnah, you don't find any mention of ladies being circumcised, or girls for that matter. This is an African invention, and pagan invention, for that matter. It also find, found its way into Islam, Muslims of that area. And the reason for that circumcision is only to, to offer a girl to a chief or a big person with the guarantee that this girl has not have had any illicit relationship with any man. Because during this circumcision, we create a round circle of stiff muscles which are sewn together. With the result that penetration is not possible anywhere. That is why when they are offered to big chiefs by the people or the tribe, the chief knows that this girl has not been used before. So this is the cruel practice and meaningless practice for that matter. So Islam strongly condemns such meaningful practices. There is no men such mention in the Holy Quran. Um, you see, to my knowledge, the word khatna, which means circumcision, is not even mentioned in the Quran anywhere. So that's why I said only Sunnah Ibrahim is mentioned, and because we know it was one of the Sunnah of Abraham, so we accept this as a tradition for men. So that man was a big rascal, who was holding the Quran before him and reading things which were not even mentioned in the Quran. Very well known in Germany as well. Yes. They, they everywhere make articles that in Islam girls get cut. Oh, this is wrong. It's very. They do it willfully, mm. just to blemish Islam for something That's Islam right. has never preached. Mm. We should write articles, counter articles, mm -hmm. telling them. Yes. Huh?